These curls is popping a F after this detox though. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. You click this video because you wanna know the three reasons why you should detox your hair. Don't fret, I'm going to get into that. But first, I'm going to show you how to make the mask, how to apply the mask to your hair, and throughout the video, I'll give you the three reasons why you need to detox your hair. So to start this off, I'm going to start with my hair damp. My hair is currently, you know, looking like this. I'm going to go ahead and, um, you know, rinse any product buildup. I washed my hair last week, so I have like twisting cream and stuff in it. So I'm going to rinse those products out and then I'm going to go section by section to detangle and apply the mask. So y'all don't think I'm tricking y'all. This video will be me applying the mask. So let's get into it. Making the bentonite clay mask. The recipe is really simple. You'll need one half cup of bentonite clay, one fourth cup of apple cider vinegar, one half cup of water, and optional one tablespoon of your oil of choice. I chose the Coil Crack Hair Growth Oil because it's great for low porosity hair and dry, itchy, flaky scalp. Now for the steps. Add your oil, apple cider vinegar, and bentonite clay to a non-metal bowl and mix that well with a non-metal spoon. Allow it to sit for 20 seconds to aerate. Then add your water and mix it well until you have no clumps. It should be the consistency of yogurt. To apply the mask. It's best that your hair is damp. I recommend rinsing out any products from your hair first and then apply the mask one section at a time. First, you'll want to detangle and apply your mask. Detangling here up front will make the washing step so much more easier and quicker. The moment you've been waiting for. Three reasons you should detox your hair. Reason number one, it reduces leftover residue from products, hard water, oils, and dead skin cells. The clay itself is a detoxifying agent. This agent can help get rid of flakiness, frizz, improve definition and volume, and add some shine. Reason number two, it rebalances the pH of your scalp. The apple cider vinegar adds this effect because of its anti-inflammatory properties and its acidity level. It resolves the residue and brings the scalp back towards its natural pH of 5.5. Reason number three, and the best reason of them all, it allows you to assess your hair from a clean slate. If you notice a change in your hair and don't know what's wrong with it, doing this detox can help you determine if you have a product buildup problem or something worse like protein overload or protein deficiency. Detoxing first can save you from causing more damage to your hair. Acting rash and doing the wrong type of treatment can really set you back. Setting the mask. Once you've applied the entire mask to your hair, you have to let it sit and dry for 20 minutes. You can put a plastic cap or a plastic bag on your head. You can also leave it uncovered. To help speed up the drying process, you can also sit under a heated dryer. I also poked holes in my cap to help it dry faster. Once the 20 minutes is up, you can and should rinse this mask out. So the mask is done and this is how my hair is looking afterwards. I haven't shampooed it or nothing. I just uh, washed the mask off. But look at these. <laughs> oh, they're looking good. Yes, Um, I will. Oh, I got a little clay still up but i will point this out i had this mask on my they say leave, your, leave it on for 20 minutes and then it's recommended to you can sit under a hooded dryer to dry it fast which y'all see that i did 20 minutes go by still not dry i don't know if it's because i used a plastic bag on top of my head but i'm not gonna sit under a hooded dryer without a plastic bag on my head and i had been sitting before the 20 minutes with the mask on this still one dry but you don't have to make sure it's all the way dry before rinsing it out as you can see i'm in good shape my hair feels clean feels detoxed really the reason i wanted to do this mask in the first place is because my hair was starting to feel as if it was like getting complacent it wasn't necessarily feeling how it felt when it was protein overloaded 
but it was kind of feeling like maybe it needed a little protein so i did incorporate protein back into like my routine but it was still feeling like a little dull or whatever so i wasn't sure like should i do a protein treatment or should i try something else so i tried the mask detox mask and doing that detox mask really did help my hair feels better it's not dull it got shine don't feel you know dry or nothing like that so i'm glad i didn't immediately do a protein treatment See? That's why you got to be on your P's and Q's. And that's why doing a detox when you feel like something is going wrong with your hair will help you. Because you can assess your hair from a clean slate. So I'm looking at my hair right now from a clean slate. No product buildup. Nothing like that. It feels great. It looks great. So my problem probably was that I had a lot of buildup going on. I'm low porosity and protein sensitive. So my hair is prone to buildup and it's prone to getting protein overloaded. So I had had took it upon myself to make sure I make sure I don't use too much protein but my hair was starting to feel like it needed something like something was going on but I knew better than to just jump into a protein treatment because my hair wasn't showing signs of needing protein like seriously or nothing like that and my hair is protein sensitive so it only need a little bit so if I had jumped into a DIY mask it would have been all over. like my hair probably would have went straight to protein overload like like that in a heartbeat it'd been looking stringy looking crazy looking a mess but I'm glad I knew a little better to just jump straight into a protein treatment. If things are wrong with your hair or your hair is feeling a little off, it doesn't always mean that you need a protein treatment. You might just need to do a detox. These curls is popping a F after this detox though. What? 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 I'm pleased with the mask. So now I'm about to um, actually go ahead and shampoo and condition my hair. And this is where this video ends. Hit the like button for more. Comment down below if you have any questions. See y'all later.